Hey Siri, what should everyone do while watching my video? Hit the subscribe button and the bell next to AJ170's name so you never miss a video. Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ170, and today guys, I'm going to be showing you yet another brand spanking new way to screen record your iOS device. Now guys, I do not know if this has a recording limit, or if it does, but I knew, do know that there is a paid version of it, so I'm guessing there might be a recording limit, but I'm not 100% sure, but I do know you can record your device with it, so it is nice to have to use as a backup in case all the other screen recorders go away. For example, when Tutu gets revoked, this could be useful as your last resort in case you're a YouTuber and you need to upload a video, or you just need to record a quick video for somebody and all the other recorders have been shut down. So credit to the guy inside the description for finding this guys go ahead check out his channel subscribe to him he's a cool guy but anyways guys can i get 170 likes also if you're a new support the 170 and subscribe so with that said let's go ahead and jump right into this video guys i'm gonna go ahead and meet you guys over on my iphone now all right guys so as you can see i'm on my iphone now so here's the app right here so it is not trusted yet so if we go ahead go to the link inside the description it should look something like this you guys want to click that blue button all the way on the bottom of the screen you might need to hit it once or twice go ahead and click the install button guys i've already installed it for me it took about almost 20 minutes for this to install this app took forever and it's not even that big it's like 20 megabytes i think it was the hawaiian or hermian or whatever it's called the servers are just like really slow so any Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and open up my settings app, and we're going to want to trust this app. In order to trust it so we can open it, what you guys are going to do is scroll down until you find general. Once you see general, scroll all the way down to the bottom to profiles device management, and then find the enterprise app. So here it is right here. I'm going to go ahead and click trust, trust again. We're going to wait, and there we go. It has now been trusted, so we can hit the home button and go ahead and open up this app. So if we go ahead and open this up and wait a couple of seconds, as you guys can see, you're going to see this right here. This little loading icon will stay up for about maybe 30 seconds to a minute and i think it stayed on my screen for about a good 30 ish 40 -ish seconds right around there it is almost done uh like i said this it's on the screen for quite some time i was surprised in how long it was actually on there then go ahead swipe all the way over and click on that little button right there then you guys should see something like this so now i'm going to go ahead and record a quick video with this screen recorder uh, so i'll be right back Alright guys, so here's the recording right here, I recorded a quick one, so if you guys want to record, click on the little red circle button on the bottom of the screen, and then if you guys can even change the name of the recording video, so this is something that, that not, uh, not that many other recorders offer, so I actually think that it's cool that this screen recorder offers that. Here are the VIP options I was telling you guys about that I have no idea what they do, I didn't translate them, I didn't feel like it. The thing works, so that's what matters. So, and then once you guys are done recording, you'll see a recording right here. So if I go ahead and play this, let's see if my screen recorder decides to actually pick it up. So let's wait a few seconds. Here it is right here. As you guys can see, it even tells you what the size of the video is while you're recording, which is really cool. And as you guys can see, it is inside of somewhat of an HD quality. So if you guys want to export this video, what you're going to do is click on that little gray circle towards the right hand side of the video and then click on that cloud icon. Once you guys click on that cloud icon, hit yes on photos and then it's going to be automatically saved to our camera roll. So if I go ahead and click on the home button, go over to photos, wait a good couple of seconds and the photos should load. Now I can go to videos and it's the 13 second long video right there guys as you guys can see there it is so this is actually completely working it even adds the video to your camera roll so that is basically going to be just about it for this video guys this is aj170 signing out see you guys next time